It's time to drop the hammer. Green flag out, we're off and running. CJ Leary's going to lead lap number one. If you picked them in the green APU, green flag challenge, you got it. Three wide for the number two spot. Here comes Cal Cummins. And Justin Grant is riding the rail as we thought he would. He's a former winner here in Knoxville, trying to make something happen on the top shelf. Yeah, he's trying to work that out there. Meanwhile, up front, challenge for your ace lead. Cummins down the inside. Devontae windows and doors, number three, our car pestering onto 15X. Nose to tail down into turn number one. He'll slip out to the middle of the racetrack. Still three wide for third on the field down the inside here comes the macho man a whole group of folks here assembled believe in kyle cummins and rightfully so the national point leader running second trying to reload at turn four drives down off the banking grabs some gravity onto the front straightaway looks to the inside to cj larry's got occupied real estate down low cj up on the high side here comes cummins he'll slip out across the racetrack kick dirt in the face of the 15 next car and go to the number one spot but everybody knows who has mostly owned the deed at this racetrack that's the 69 of Brady Bacon, and he's turning the dirt on the bottom. Meanwhile, slide job up front. C.J. Leary took a shot. Bacon takes a shot. Double sliders down three and four, and back onto the point goes the three yard car. Able to turn it back to the inside of C.J. Leary. Moves back into P1 on the field. Still trying to close a slide job on himself for the number 69 car, trying to make a move on to 15X to C.J. Leary. Here comes Bacon down to the inside. 69, blazes one out across the racetrack. He'll pick up P2 for now. Can C.J. get back down the inside? Not so quick. Drivers red in second and third have been a national champion. The guy out front is desperately wanting to get one. Now Cummins is about to have some company because Brady Bacon's got her wicked up. Brady Bacon, who continues to mount a stride towards the top spot all time, and USAC wins, is closing on Kyle. And now within about three or four car lengths down in the corner, there is a blistering pace down that end of the racetrack. Look at the drive out of the 69. Cummins slipping the grip. Here goes Bacon down low. Slide job out across the racetrack. 69 going to P1. Cummins has got a battle back. Yeah, he looked to the left and thought, oh no, not that guy. And there's Brady Bacon. But Kyle Cummins will not give up, and C.J. Leary's trying to join the party. Pressure on the 15, coming out Jake Swanson, 21 AZ down on the inside. Team Arizona Racing pressuring for a P3, a final podium position on C.J. Leary. Leary able to shrug him off and hang on to it for now. Emerson Axum just back behind the 21 AZ. Well, he comes in, does Swanson not, with a run of about three straight podium finishes, looking for four. He has been absolutely on a roll. And there goes Jake fighting CJ right there. He's going to try again down on the inside. Slide job will work that time. He'll flip the whiskers on the 15X car. Back to the inside goes CJ. Swanson, good drive, coming out of the corner. Up to P3 he goes. CJ shuffle back into fourth on the field. Another good run by Jake Swanson. And we do have battle for second. Out of the corner we come, and it's going to last for a very short period of time as Jake Swanson just sucked the numbers off the 3R car. Blows past him down into the corner, picks up P2, jumps the cushion ever so lightly, and quickly gathers things back together again, puts the spurs to the flanks, and trying to run down Bacon up front in these final four laps. Meanwhile, up front, here comes the white flag for your race leader. It is, but I'm telling you right now, Jake Swanson is quick. Swanson down into the corner, trying to close on Bacon. Can he get around Bacon? Yes. Boy, he's cornering like a mouse yes, and sneakers. Can. Here comes the run out of turn number two and down the back straightaway. Jake Swanson, does Brady Bacon have a tire problem? Here goes Jake, working to the inside. Can Jake steal this one away? Got it, checkered flag comes out. The Avani windows and doors. Cornbell flash goes to Jake Swanson into 21 AZ with the last lap, last corner pass. What a beautiful run for Jake Swanson. <laughs> to be honest with you, I, I knew that the rubber was coming, but I didn't think that I was going to have a shot to win the thing. Um, the rubber came like really hard and really fast. I didn't, I didn't expect that, but we sure capitalized on it. Um, I, was, uh, I was just so tight in and to it, and I just had to be, be really ginger with it because I smashed it a couple times down there and the thing biked up. Um, and I was like, the whole time I was like, man. <laughs> I wish I could talk to my crew chief right now. And then, <laughs> and then sure enough, we end up doing all of, you know, the, the, the turn of events took place that, that, that did it, it did, you know, it was amazing. Um, I just, 
I couldn't believe that that we were so good in the rubber, and it was all a testament to to Mike's choices. You know, I think he knew that that, that everything was going to be coming.